Get ready for the dictation. 10 seconds. Five seconds. Start. Mr. Speaker, sir, many honorable members have spoken on these demands since yesterday and have dealt with various subjects. So far as I am concerned, I would like to confine myself to the general policy followed by the government in respect of matters relating to these demand. First of all, I would like to know from the government what their agricultural plan is. I want to know whether they have posted proper person in various places. Take for instance the head of agriculture department. As a matter of fact, in the course of the last 18 months, there have been three or four changes. I have nothing to say about the present incumbent of the post. But I have my own doubts whether he will be continued in the post for three or four years. I want that the government must post proper officers and once they are posted, they should be continued for at least three years in the same posts. I hope the government will consider this matter. Secondly, I want to know whether the increase in food production is commensurate with the expenditure on it. I would like to know the policy of the government with regard to reducing the cost of production. What is the policy of the government of India in this matter? I want to know whether they can guarantee a minimum price both to the consumer and to the producer. With regard to agriculture and irrigation, I find that there is no coordination between the two departments. Take for instance the case of Tanjavur. The riots there want water to be let in early to rise the nursery in time. But the irrigation department is not helpful with the result that there is a great deal of delay in the raising of the nursery. I would very much like the government to see that such delays are avoided. Then, so much has been said about the Grow More Food campaign. But if we examine the question whether proper check is made about the working of this department, I should say that there is no proper check. In the same way, so far as river pumping schemes are concerned, I request the Honorable Minister for Agriculture to tell the House how much these schemes 
have contributed to the increase in food production with these few words i support the cut motion thank you sir letter from vasant and company chennai to thiru r srinivasan villupuram dear sir we are in receipt of your letter of the third instant we are sorry to note that the washing machine that we have supplied and installed is not working properly usually we check our material before it is sent it was done in this case also and the machine was found to be in order however perhaps some defect has crept in during the course of transportation we shall send our local mechanic to check the machine and see that the defect if any is rectified if still the machine is not in order we assure you that we shall supply you another new machine and take back the machine that has been already supplied we are interested in the satisfaction of our customers we regret the inconvenience caused to you we shall take steps to see that such things do not occur in future yours faithfully